at the time it was Vince. Nobody else came to Dustin, Vince did. And, you know, I remember him hanging up the phone going like, oh my God, like he wants me to be this outlandish, crazy, um, like almost like an androgyny. He, he, er he, he didn't know what the word androgyny meant at the time, now he does. If you didn't know um, if his character, his character was all about messing with your mind, you know if he was total, gay. Total. 90s, if, you, total, if yeah. you were being gay, if you were straight, if you were weird. Right. And Dustin also is a big movie fan. That and, but at the other side of that little spectrum, Dustin was a boot wearing, tobacco chewing, six foot five Texan. The last thing you would think he would be able to do is pull off this character that Vince brought to him. And he had trepidation initially. And then we talked about it and I'm like, you know, if you're gonna do it, you better do it and do it right. Cause there's no, there's no halfway with this character. There's just none. And he went on the road, he did it. He wore a gold bodysuit that showed every bump, bulge and everything else. And, um, you know, that was that. That's amazing that most people don't, well, they give Vince the credit for creating The Undertaker, mm -hmm. for creating Kane, who are characters. He also helped and created Goldust. Mm -hmm. Big time. But like how, I consider myself a creative person. Never would I want to be like, I want a guy who is dressed like, you know, in gold with face paint to be, a, Think of that, that's pretty amazing. Especially when you're talking about the antithesis of something like that. Right. When you say, I want to take this guy that is nothing like this. Cause With think, an established th name. Think about it, exactly. That's even more so. Think about it, every human being that is in the business, we all, even Goldust, we take something from our private lives and bring it onto the stage, the screen, yes. the, whatever. That character, Dustin had to leave so much outside of the character and become the character, that's why I give him so much credit and kudos for him to pull that off. Like, it was amazing. It was also, um, it was funny. I remember like Dream always saying, the only other person who saw that picked it up, and I know it's his son, but it, it's true, because Dusty could also remove himself from that. He would be like, Barry Windham was a natural. Yep. And he's like, so was Dustin. Yep, he goes, he always. was a natural. Yep. And uh, he goes, you just picked it up like Smooth, that. Smooth, yeah. And if you look at the way he moved. Especially for his size. Yeah, most, yep. like another person. You don't realize how big Dustin is. Same with like Barry Windham, mm -hmm. man. And I wrestled both those guys. Uh, Barry has shrunk because like ankles and mm -hmm. you shrink when you break your neck, all that stuff. But gigantic men mm -hmm. that are moving or even back then considered smaller because everyone is like the land of the giants. Yeah.